what was the goal with Intermission? What was the what what did you set out to do when you started writing that song? Uh, I really love those um, those finale songs. You know, when you get to the last track on an album and it's twice as long as every other track, and it just has this very big sound, I guess. Um, it just and it just really it's kind of you know the fireworks at the end of the album. <laughs> Um, so that was almost in my mind, I think, um, when I started writing Intermission. Uh, almost the, the kind of structure that came before, before anything else. It's basically to do uh, in fundamentally with um, getting a bit older, you know, realising <laughs> the world's sort of catching up with you. And, um, that kind of feeling of ageing and, and kind of things. And I know. <laughs> You say, like, we're not that old yet. Um, but sometimes you do kind of turn around and realise that perhaps you weren't quite as young as, as you once were. I felt like I was being spoiled when you <laughs> really came with that song. I was like, there's so, there's so much to take out of it, especially from the perspective of the words, because um, the the prog the chord progression is like is sort of very, is very it's very simplistic, it's very minimalist, um, but it sort of builds on itself uh, continuously. And I think I think that even when you were playing it to me uh, as like this sort of solo voice and guitar arrangement. I could just hear all of the stuff like building as the song progressed. Yeah, and it was uh, it, it it felt really uh, really emotionally charged, and I was I was ready to delve into that. Yeah, this was probably the most interesting song that we um, that because of what happened when we when we went through the pre-production stage um, is that we really. Um, we kind of completely rejigged that ending. So originally, how we've rehearsed is that when that guitar solo kicks in right towards the end, um, it just flows through, kind of in an uninterrupted, right till that last, um, the little when the little melody comes back in, in the quiet, the acoustic guitar and the, the little electric, at the end. Um, but Matt sort of put his kind of slightly more pop spin on things and was like. Personally, I'd want to hear like the chorus one more time because it, it does. It did obviously before that only only really reappear twice. Um, so after we'd recorded the pre-production take, you really sort of chopped up the bits and uh, and we could see you recorded some some quick quick vocals, which uh, I think are actually the ones that st are still in the track. Maybe I was I was. Being, being a touch ironic uh, because I knew that this song had to be the last one on the album um, but obviously it's, it's slightly cheeky called Intermission which is obviously not really something that happens very much in the middle um, but I kind of took that concept and the kind of I guess the point is that the, the narrator is, is saying to to the audience or, or this person that he's perhaps meeting is that, okay, we've lived kind of the first half of our lives, we're aware of how much time has already passed, um, but what about the second half? You know, we've only reached the intermission. Um, we still really have the climax and the resolution of our, our own lives to, to, to yet unfold. So how do you think that people are gonna react to this song? Um, in comparison to like the, all of this other stuff <laughs> that we've got on this album, yeah. I guess it's kind of one of those songs that you um, you hope that people like, especially if um, you know a gig or whatever, um, the people just kind of take stock and have a little reflective kind of episode <laughs> at the end of end of the night, really, um, and I think. Um, like I said, I was trying to recreate that 
that's kind of very specific, um, you know, rock ballad uh, that I like, and I think there's a lot of people out there that that also really like that. So hopefully, um, when they listen to Intermission, they kind of get kind of pick up on it on a similar feeling and, and really kind of vibe with it. It'd be nice. <laughs>